a woman who had a lot of money problems the place where she used to work after the death of that owner suddenly they get all the property, lots of secrets came out with this property can we trust each other too, hi movie long and short here today I want to explain a film called Dangerous Lies, the story begins with a girl named Katie, she can be seen working in a diner, her husband Adam, was waiting for her shift to end. Actually they got married at a very young age, Adam is in school and Katie supports him both of them were very hopeful that if Adam gets a good job then their situation will change. Suddenly a man starts robbing the diner with a gun when the man was not paying attention, Adam attacked him he saved the people there, now 4 months have passed since this incident, Katie takes a new job she takes care of a rich old man name of this old man was Leonard he was looking at his garden and said that when I was young there was a very beautiful garden here, Katie says you can hire someone to build the garden, Leonard said that I had hired a man but one day suddenly he disappeared after that no one could find him, we will know more about this later in the movie after this, when Katie comes to the house we come to know that she is very angry with Adam these days, Adam had left his education there were a lot of loans running on him and it was getting very difficult to pay him so Adam thinks he will do the job and pay it all, Katie was refusing him for this but Adam did not agree she says you never listen to anything, there was no need to attack the man at the diner that day he had a gun, you could have died. Katie was upset and was thinking outside Leonard's house so Leonard felt that someone is in the house he comes out with a gun directly, Katie asks him why did you bring the gun he said that I always hear someone's voice in the house, Katie said that there is no one in the house, let's talk about the fight she had with Adam tonight, Leonard said that let me help you with the money but Katie refused him and says Adam needs a job then from the next day, Adam gets a job here to manage the garden, one day a real estate agent came to his house named Mickey, Mickey tells Katie my client liked this house very much he can pay as much as you want, Katie tells him that the owner here doesn't want to sell the house but Mickey was very consistent, Katie felt very strange, Adam wonders what this house will cost, Adam was again trying to improve their relationship and Katie liked to the agency through which Katie got the job, his owner comes to visit Leonard he was asking him how Katie was taking care of him and taking care of people do not take any advantage of them, that's why I always keep inspecting, today Leonard paid Katie when she later looks at this check it was for $7000, this was a lot of money these two are unable to figure out how this happened, Katie then remembers that she talked to Leonard about their financial situation she says we have to go back again we can't take this money but today they were very late. If they don't pay the bill etc their electricity will be cut so Adam says today we deposit this check and will return the rest of the money. Next day when Katie came to Leonard's place for work he had died this death was natural. Katie feels really bad when Adam came up to him. Leonard was holding a key in his hand he wonders whose key is it then he opened a box containing many of Leonard's belongings. In this he sees photo of Leonard's girlfriend she had an accident when she was young so Leonard never married he got a lot of money under this box. Now both of them discuss what will have to be done for this, Adam says that if we tell anyone about this money then the money will fall somewhere in the locker of the police we need this money very much. Katie also agrees for this after this the police investigation took place. Detective leaves from here after asking them some questions, Adam and Katie had decided that till the police investigation is not over, the whole routine will be kept the same today Katie again goes to her agency to look for new jobs, manager there told her that we cannot give you any new job until the police investigation is over after this, Adam also gave an interview in a very good company but he too gets rejected, he then came to see the money in Leonard's house but he hears some sound from below. He went to see it but someone attacked him from behind when he regains consciousness he calls Katie to him, Katie was wondering why someone attacked Adam, Adam says because the money we got was $100,000, he counted, Adam thinks someone working in the first house may have known about the money, Leonard has previously said that he hired a gardener, maybe he could be, now it is not safe to keep this money here then they taking a locker on rent and keeping them there when both of them were going from here so Mickey who is a real estate agent or not, was keeping an eye on these two both of them were very happy today so they get intimate after coming home, detective calls Katie to police station to complete last formality she asks what to do with Leonard's body, Katie says he wanted his ashes to be spread in his garden, 
If Leonard has no one in this world then his wish will be fulfilled by Katie it will take a lot of money for this, still Katie was ready to pay the detective also found this thing strange when Katie and Adam were at the memorial, Leonard's lawyer comes over there she told them that Leonard had given all the property to Katie one day suddenly Leonard had called her secretly. Katie could not believe this both of them were very happy. When Katie and lawyer were alone the lawyer tells her, you have to be careful now, if something goes wrong in the police investigation then everything can be lost from your hands you have got all the property, this can cause problems for Adam too you have to be a little more careful. Adam and Katie were very happy about their future they make different plans. Next day they shifted to Leonard's house, Adam got a call from the police station and was called to meet him when he reaches there, he learns that no one had called him, detective noticed this thing it seems that Adam in some kind of suspense, Mickey came to the house again today to meet Katie he says that I came to know about Leonard now someone will have to sell this property, Katie says that I have got all the property and I am not going to sell, Mickey doesn't believe in this he says that anyone can make such type of will. I will keep an eye on you, Katie said that now this time you will talk to my lawyer, at night Katie was disturbed she tells Adam about everything, Adam says we should ignore Mickey, the less things we have in the police investigation is better, Katie notices a watch from Adam in the bathroom which was very expensive, Adam was saying earlier that he doesn't want to be poor again, Katie told him that he should not do anything like this. Everything should look normal but Adam is not agreeing to this the next day while investigating. The detective comes to Katie and she comes to know that Katie has found this house. Detective again we got suspicious of these two she did the investigation. Leonard gave Katie a check for $7,000 when she finds out about this and then begins to doubt them even more. Katie was a little scared about everything these days. She searches Leonard's office why did he keep so much money. Adam says that what difference does it make now you should also let this thing go. Detective spoke to the manager of Katie's agency. Manager gets very angry he thinks maybe Katie was taking advantage of Leonard. Today, when Katie was checking the house there was a secret door in it, inside which she finds a dead body at one place. She got very scared she was crying by disturbed. Adam supports her. Katie says who killed that man and why, Adam shows Katie a lot of diamonds he is said that because of this, Adam had previously discovered that dead body and these diamonds were lying near the dead body, Katie thinks he's probably the same gardener who worked here, while watching these diamonds suddenly the manager of Katie's agency reaches there he gets very angry but Katie does not allow him to enter the house, Katie was telling Adam that we should inform the police about this dead body. Adam says that if there is any other problem in this investigation then we can lose everything he hides this body, they were sleeping in the night when someone's voice came to them in the house, Adam had also bought a gun without informing Katie, he comes out with this gun but on the stairs was the manager of the agency, he got scared seeing a gun and he falls down he had died instantly the police are called to investigate this, detective has spoken to Katie. She says that very strange things are happening here and it started happening when Adam started working here before that everything was normal, I know you're not involved in all this but you should keep an eye on Adam, seeing Adam's suspension behavior, Katie also started suspecting him the next day, Katie again went to the lawyer she tells the whole thing to him lawyer said that if the police think that Adam must have done all this then they will search the house you have to keep everything very safe, Katie then with the lawyer where the locker was kept going there and checking, there was no money in the locker, so the lawyer says that Adam is cheating on you. He will run away from here quickly when Katie came home. Adam was packing with all the money he says that I felt that someone is following me for many days. I found out more about that real estate agent he actually did a robbery. Robbery belonged to the same diamonds. His partner in this robbery was Gardner and he was shot by the police. There was a very good place in Leonard's house to hide him so he came here and hide. Mickey is very dangerous he can kill them too then both of them were running away together suddenly Mickey entered the house, he put a gun on Katie and asks where is Diamond, Adam also took out his gun, says let her go, Mickey suits Adam, Adam was very injured, Mickey went to see him then Adam also shoot him, Katie went to him, Adam's condition was very bad she cries a lot Adam died near her she feels so bad that she doubted Adam, while looking for Katie, 
The lawyer came to her whatever happened she tells all these things to the lawyer. Lawyer says that Mickey was very stupid he didn't even know how to do a small job she tells the price of diamond and talks. Then it was three million dollars. Katie doubted her then the lawyer also told everything she said that I was representing Mickey she was fed up with her situation so that is why she helped Mickey in robbery. She puts a gun on Katie and asks where are the diamonds she was about to kill her then the detective reached there and killed the lawyer. Katie had already called the detective. After this four months have passed we see that Katie was pregnant. Detective comes to her and gives congratulation for baby. Katie says that I don't know anything about diamonds right now. It was Adam who kept them safe. After this detective left from here we see Katie maintaining Leonard's garden. Here some water fell under the tree and this is where we can see the diamond. These diamonds were now found by Katie police case is also over. Now she will not face any problem. With this the movie ends. Subscribe for more videos like this, turn on notification, and leave a like to help the channel out. Thanks for watching.